This is Carl White with Live in Charlotte at the Myers Park Country Club, and we're here with Lutz Gorgon, the consulate for the Federal Republic of Germany. Lutz, welcome back to Charlotte, and share with us why you're here today. Carl, Happy New Year. Uh, I'm here, and we are all here to celebrate Kurt Waldhausen, the German honorary consul in uh, North Carolina. And this evening's uh, particular celebration, together with the, the mayor of Charlotte, Patrick McCrory, uh, was to present the uh, Cross of the Order of Merit to Kurt Waldhausen for his outstanding transatlantic achievements. He is a wonderful citizen who has brought so many uh, people together from Germany to North Carolina and uh, from here, from Charlotte, uh, across the Atlantic. The German president, Horst Köhler, has uh, awarded Kurt Waldhausen with the Cross of the Order of Merit. I read uh, the citation in both German and English. In Anerkennung der um die Bundesrepublik Deutschland erworbenen besonderen Verdienste verleihe ich Herrn Kurt Gerhard Waldhausen, Honorarkonsul der Bundesrepublik Deutschland, das Verdienstkreuz am Bande des Verdienstordens der Bundesrepublik Deutschland. And this is in English. In recognition of his special merits for the Federal Republic of Germany, I bestow the cross of merit of the Federal Republic of Germany on Kurt Waldhausen. Now, Kurt, uh, ever since he came here in about 1982, he's just jumped into this community. And not only that, but he brought the German community with him because they actually come from a culture in which um, they depend upon government to be involved in the community, not regular citizens or the private sector. And uh, Kurt just put that over his head and, and got involved in Charlotte and has really made a positive difference. And I'm proud to call him my friend. We're honoring someone very special in our community. Kurt has done outstanding work for as long as he's been here, and it is a very exciting evening for us, and it's great to be part of this event. Well, I'm here, of course, to support Kurt Waldhausen, one of the finest uh, citizens that we have here in Charlotte. He's a great friend. We're in Rotary Club together. We do a lot of things together, and he has done so much to help infuse the German community with the rest of the community. And I have to say from the bottom of my heart I congratulate him because he is really the German in town who really really deserves the Bundesverdienstkreuz. Um, it's been an amazing experience. Kurt as you know is, is involved with everything international in, in the city of Charlotte especially international education. Uh, he's been a board member, he's on the advisory board and thanks to his uh, 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 benefit that he organized in the South End, he this year is sending three high school teachers to Germany and Austria. Three high school teachers, two from CMS and one from another school. So he's been always involved with the World Affairs Council, very in-depth. Uh, we had the uh, German ambassador come as a guest of the World Affairs Council and Kurt last year, so he's involved in many levels and we're very grateful to have someone as Kurt in this community. I'm here with Thomas Mueller, a global economist. I know now is a trying time for you, Thomas, but tell me what it meant for you tonight to see a fellow German win this prestigious award. Well, first of all, it uh, showed and highlighted to me the great relationship that Germany and America share. And I was particularly proud to see Kurt Waldhausen, who is one of our biggest, uh, biggest and best proponents in uh, Charlotte and in North Carolina to uh, receive this award. He is an excellent man and I wish that there were many more Kurt Waldhausens uh, available uh, to do the work that needs to be done to bring Germany and America together. And on top of it, I just want to say that the relationship between Germany and America is very, very close as Kurt uh, brought out tonight. And I think that gets lost amid the political disagreements between Germany and America, but basically our two nations are friendly, beyond friendship, I think. Uh, we have walked uh, through steel baths together in history, and I think it is a great honor to be here tonight and celebrate that German-American friendship. Well, this award, what it really means to me is that uh, I'm thinking of my grandfather, Walter Kramer, who I spoke about. He gave his life for uh, Germany that I think we have uh, uh, managed to establish thanks also in part to our American friends. And as I said in my speech, I think he would be proud 
that I serve a Germany today that is deeply rooted in on democratic principles, that has a strong alliance with the United States, and uh, I think he would uh, agree with me that this is the Germany that he, he envisioned when when uh, when when he was. Uh, trying to get rid of the Nazi regime and Adolf Hitler. What this is what it really means for me primarily and other than that what it means to me that I have thoroughly enjoyed to uh, 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 serve the community. Um, I think as I said most of my American friends I've met through volunteering and these have remained friends, even if I rotated off boards or did different things. So uh, uh, it has been a wonderful journey and, and volunteering has given more to me and my family than I'm afraid I was able to give back.